Assalamu alaikum my name is Maz Asif and today we are discussing on the topic defense day with Ayan Bey Wa alaikum assalam i am honored to be here to discuss such a significant topic and such a relevant day for our nation also known as defense day well what is defense day well defense day is celebrated when our armed forces protected lahore against the opposing enemies and they were partially successful mostly successful in the defense of lahore which was a vital vital city at this time and at that time so the they defended it with bravery courage and never ending determination well what really caused defense day the partition of 1947 and building of unfulfilled promises and arguably the most important reason the operation gibraltar well what is operation gibraltar well operation Gibra uh, gibraltar was oper uh, staged or operated by a handful of people chiefs leaders it uh, it uh, it consisted of 30000 pakistani infantry units which were dressed in civilian clothing and they were sent to infiltrate the muslim majority of kashmir to spark an uprising well operation but this however I'm, I'm, okay. my apologies but this was however unsuccessful and the pakistani force at the opposing side found out and they retaliated and pushed back the pakistani forces which was a major setback in the primary objective in the 65 conflict well pakistan decided to go in the city of ankur and uh, it is also known as the operation grand slam can you please tell about that well operation grand slam it is shrouded in multiple perspectives mm -hmm. but let me i'll tell you some of the major events that happened um one of them was when the pakistani forces attacked and pressurized the city of aknur um the the uh our eastern neighbors they retali retaliated with launching operation riddle in hopes to to ease the pressure in aknur which was successful and thus lahore, lahore was caught off guard and it resulted in in a in a panic they sent half a, uh, of a huge number of their units back to lahore to defend it hmm well there are many things to talk about uh, the defense day well the most significant the one of the most one of the most significant battle is battle of chiwanda it is known as the biggest tank battle after world war 2 and uh, uh, can you please tell about the patriotism shows and sacrifices made in this war Uh, absolutely uh, uh the one of the one of the most one of the more memorable let's talk about war heroes one of the more memorable war heroes was as we all know mma mma also known as mohammed mahmud alam mm -hmm. who f f uh, who was flying a f86 saber fighter jet and he took down five planes in 30 seconds 300 jets and two uh, other jets and his current plane is a uh, uh, stored in a museum in Karachi hmm and he was also given the nickname of little dragon and another memorable war hero is major raja aziz who was given the award nishan e haider which is known as the highest military rank award he was martyred while defending the lahore region and uh, he was given the nishan e haider award and now we have 
uh, conveyed our message? Well, I I want to talk about uh, one more thing. Mm. It, it's uh, we we as the youth should uh, understand that all these promises that our elders made, uh, all, sorry, all these sacrifices our elders made, all these all these you know all the these the bloodshed, all the sweat, blood, and tears, and you know as the younger generation we shouldn't forget all these all these sacrifices and, and sacrifices and efforts they made to form the nation known as Pakistan today so i think it's important that all of us not only the youth even the elders should acknowledge this and you know not this is something that should not be forgotten and this should, is something that should not be repeated mm, i agree it really should be acknowledged to all of us about history and especially about this war now let's end our discussion here and what do you think about defense day please let us know in the comments